Jason, thoughts on living below your means and potentially to save and invest as much as possible. I still lift and eat well, but I don't really spend uh, all the time. I think that's great, humanity. That's the way to go. I literally get trolls who are like, why do you live in a condo? Why don't you drive a car if you're making certain amounts of money? And I'm like, uh, because I want to be rich one day. I don't squander my money. Why gym equipment so expensive these days and does it take time to have the equipment you have? Yeah, it took me a long time to build this gym, bro. Are you uh, That's a lot of cool equipment in the gym background. How much money would one need for a gym like yours? I have about 30,000 US dollars in my home gym at this point. I don't squander my money. I know you like tens for hypertrophy, but what about sets of two closets? 30K, are there diamonds in those plates? No, add it up, Luke. Go to all the rogue websites and start adding up everything that I have. I don't squander my money. I mean, my plates alone are several thousand dollars. I don't squander my money. Just my plates. Keep in mind, I have 500 pounds of calibrated plates and I have over 500 pounds or around 500 pounds of the competition humper plates. Right. I have $4,000 just in plates from Rogue. Uh, how I don't squander my money. Luke, all his plates are calibrated. Look at the specialty bars he has. Look at his racket attachment. He has a lot of equipment. Yeah, I mean, I legitimately have 30000 in my home gym. Like, I'm, I'm not exaggerating. If you guys were to actually add all of it up and go check websites, you'll see that I'm actually being serious. Uh, do you think you can make a decent home gym with 2.5K for the start? No, absolutely. I don't squander my money. Dude, $2,500 will build you a great starting home gym. I have about 30,000 US dollars in my home gym at this point. You don't have to have all the stuff that I do. I don't use over half the stuff that I have at this point. I don't squander my money. But I have it if I ever want to use it. I basically decided I built a gym with the idea of anything that I would ever possibly need to work around any injury or angle that I would have it already there. Like, why do you live in a condo? Why don't you drive a car if you're making certain amounts of money? I have about 30,000 US dollars in my home gym at this point. I don't squander my money.